Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody. Right now let's go back to the discussion of the gold market. Uh, if you remember guys, our the major concern on the gold market in the weekend was around the possible existence of the bullish dynamic pressure. So that was the Monday candle and it, it uh, hasn't been created yet on the Sunday. So you can see that here action indeed has remind the possible bullish dynamic pressure that could uh, theoretically lead to the further upward jump here. But yesterday market uh, has formed another pattern that uh, significantly increased the chance of the downward continuation. And uh, this reduce, reduces the chance of the bullish dynamic pressure because market, uh, in fact by this candle, has confirmed the bearishness of uh, trend shifting. So you can see that initially trend has shifted bearish, but price action was not really to the downside. But yesterday, by this drop, although it, no, it was not really very strong, but in fact that is an action that, uh, as you can see, engulfs and cancelled the upward action within the previous two sessions, and almost in the three sessions. And what is more important, the market has formed here another bearish grabber. So right now we have two valid bearish grabbers in place. So that was the first one that has been formed on Thursday, in the previous week, last week. And that is another one that has been formed yesterday. So we have the two bearish grabbers and uh, with this grabber market also is showing the downward action. It means that in the short term perspective the chances of the downward continuation has increased significantly. On the hourly chart uh, we said that mostly whether market will continue to move higher or lower is the question of this possible head and shoulder pressure. So that was also the previously the butterfly, if you remember. So you can see that's 127 pattern, 127 extension, because the head stands at 127 to the shoulders. And uh, in weekend we said that there are two crucial moments exist, two crucial candles exist, uh, sorry, uh, points exist that will det determine the perspective of the market in the short term period. And we said if market on Monday will take it out of this top, that was in fact the top of the bearish grabber. And we'll break the neckline to the upside. That will tell us that the bullish dynamic pressures really exist on the daily chart. And it really could trigger the further up prediction right to taking out of the stop and the hand shoulders could bring and give us this A, B, C, D pattern. That's normal behavior with the hand shoulders. But if market will take it out of the loss of the shoulder, that will confirm, that will, that will lead to the failure of this pattern and significantly increase the chance of the downward behavior. Because in fact, the most cases when the market taken out of the loss of the shoulder, it means the failure of the hand shoulders itself. And that's why, as you can see, what we have right now, the drop that taken out of this loss, and right now market stands mostly in the same ABCD retracement after this drop. So it means that mostly the, the situation uh, is bearish and the chance on the bearish development has increased. And if you are searching the possibility for the taking the short position, that should probably become some re resistance areas from this most recent thrust. So we could uh, draw the few levels here from this most recent thrust and take one of them for taking the short. Uh, you could place the stop above the neckline because that will simultaneously the stop above that most recent bearish grabber. Because the market will return right back down and uh, return above the neckline, that will be something. And that will be not the normal bearish development. So that's in fact the invalidation point for the bearish setup. Until that will happen, any ABC retracement here, this will be just a retracement and it will keep chance on the possible downward continuation. That's our short term uh, analysis on the gold market. So in fact, that shortly speaking, the bearish setup is exist until these grabbers will exist. If market order had become taken out of these tabs and will shift trend to the bullish, that will mean uh, that the bearish short-term setup has failed and market probably will take it out of the step and really 
could continue even through the acceleration here. Uh, but until this will happen, setup is bearish, and if you would like to take the short position, as I said, take if you could take it on some fib resistance on this most recent trust, you could place and stop above this top.